Hello friends. Today we will be using our ruler to measure. Yes, we are going to be using our rulers to measure. But friends, before we start, before we go on with this lesson, could anyone tell me what is going on with all of our rulers? What is going on? Yes, friends, they are not a whole ruler. We know a normal ruler will have 12 inches, right? It will have 12 inches. However, these are considered broken rulers. Yes, broken rulers. So friends, I have a question. Can we measure with a broken ruler? Actually, we can because what you need to know, what is most important is that you know that each space represents an inch. Each space represents an inch. Could someone tell me what does each space represent? Yes, friends, an inch. So each space represents an inch. So before we start measuring, could somebody tell me how many inches is in this ruler? We're not measuring the item. Just tell me how many inches are in this ruler. Let's do it together. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Friends, did you notice Miss Jordan counted the space? Did you notice Miss Jordan counted each space? Why did Miss Jordan count each space? Because we know that each space represents an inch. Each space represents an inch. So with that, we can start anywhere we want. And all we have to do is count the spaces. So let's do the first item together. Let's start right here. So we're gonna start right here at four, right? We're gonna start right here at four. But do we say, do we start at four? Do we say four, five, six, seven? Do we do that? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Oh, I see some thumbs up. I see some thumbs down. Friends, no, we started one because guess what? This is a broken ruler. And guess what? The item did not start at one, right? So we have to start the item at one. So get ready, friends. We're going to start right here, but we're going to start at one. So let's count. How long is this Hershey bar? Let's count. One, two, Three. Oh, friends, three. But look, why didn't Miss Jordan count over here? Because guess what, friends? The Hershey bar didn't go that far over. It was within these three inches. So let's count it again to make sure. Let's count. One, two, three. So we know that this Hershey bar is three inches. Okay. All right, let's start with our next item. So here's a fork. So just to let you know, all of the um, items, all of the items um, gonna have a broken ruler. We're gonna measure with a broken ruler. So I'll get ready. All right, let's count. Let's start. One, two, Three. Oh, friends, this item is three inches as well, friends. Three inches as well. Yes. Let's count the hot dog. Oh, that looks good. Let's count it. One, two, three inches. Wow, friends. Three inches as well. That's a lot of. Item says three inches, huh? All right, let's count the Laffy Taffies. One, two, 
three, four inches, four inches. Again, friends, don't forget, we are counting the spaces, okay? So let's count that again. One, two, three, four, four inches, friends, four inches. All right, let's count the Skittles. All right, can we start here? No, because the Skittles don't start over here. Can we start here? Absolutely not. So let's go. One, two, two inches, friends. Two inches. And let's count our last one. Let's count our last one, friends. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, five inches. Five inches, friends. Five inches. So, friends, that is how that, that is how the broken ruler goes that is how the broken ruler rule goes so again what are we what are we measuring let me see hmm yes the spaces the spaces tell us exactly how many inches the item is and friends, just because it's a broken ruler doesn't mean that we can't measure because guess what? We are counting the spaces to measure because we know each space represents an inch. And that is all that I have, friends.